What is the punishment for pilots that eject from their jets? Well, they can be banned from flying forever. Let me explain. Today's ejection seats operate on a two-phase system. The first phase involves the pilot activating the ejection gun by pulling a handle, propelling the seat upward and out of the airplane. But the second phase is a rocket located beneath the seat, a blazing burst lasting around 0.2 seconds, firing the pilot and seat approximately 100 feet into the sky, safely away from the aircraft. However, when ejecting, pilots can experience forces of up to 16 Gs during the second phase. The consequences are severe, ranging from air blast bruising to leg fractures from hitting the cockpit and neck injuries like whiplash. Shockingly, around 30% of pilots experience spinal fractures during the ejection process, a condition that can lead to a permanent ban on flying fighter jets. Unfortunately, when things go wrong, sometimes there's no other option but to eject.